The thing that we want to do with the Precision Health Initiative and the Libin Institute is create the next practice. So we want the next level of care. We want to bring tomorrow's healthcare today. And the way to do that is going to be using this advanced analytic tool like machine learning and artificial intelligence and harnessing all of the data. It's about learning from every single patient that comes through the front doors of the Institute and receives care. And it's about being more individualized, more personalized, and more precise about their care. Alberta is already ahead of the game. Alberta has done a phenomenal job of integrating the healthcare system with digitization. We have incredible electronic health tools at our disposal, and the Libin Institute wants to build on that. We have a unique opportunity in Alberta to leverage all the decisions that have made in patients with cardiovascular disease over the past couple decades and learn from them. To be able to bring that data together in the best possible way to predict how future patients can be better managed. By bringing together all the information about an individual patient, from the electronic health record to the medical images to the genetics, we can build a better healthcare system that can predict and anticipate what's going to happen. By doing so, we can improve the care decisions that we make, deliver better outcomes, and reduce healthcare costs. I think there is a lot of opportunity. I think part of that comes from realizing the potential of the data that is in the system because there's a lot of benefit that can be created from utilizing that in a really meaningful and responsible way. And we've curated this team of incredible people where we're all kind of wayfinding this together. And so one of the benefits of that and one of the challenges, but something that we've really embraced is the fact that we could create our own team. So this is great for the community because what, where I see this going is that we will need to partner with many people in the community who have startups, who have you know, artificial intelligence technology or digitization technology or remote wearable technology. I can tell you that as a physician, there is such a moral responsibility to do something great for the patient. We want patients to do well. We're excited at the Libin Cardiovascular Institute to be at the heart of innovation. And we want to bring the next practices to become the best practices.